The earliest version of the 2019 BG Falcons was on display Friday afternoon at Stellar Field. The team did a two-inning inter-squad game, showcasing the first live action for Chase Antle, who after not facing live action in nearly 18 months, says he's now stronger as a pitcher and as a person. Uh, me being hurt this past year and a half is probably the best thing that ever happened to me. I took a lot of things for granted before, and uh, now I just kind of learned. You can't take those days for granted anymore, and you just got to get better each and every day if you want to keep playing the game for as long as you can. After multiple seniors graduated at the conclusion of spring semester, it will be up to some veteran leaders to fill those empty spots. Two candidates to fill them, Jeff Scott and Jake Wilson. Everybody does something well, and I think we're going to stick to that and kind of go from there. Um, just try to play your own game and not do too much, not do too little, and kind of find that happy medium and do what you do well. I'm not putting any pressure on myself. I'm just going to try and keep the same thing I'm doing, and I'm going to have a team behind me as well. They will help me pick me up because I won't be successful every time. For, that's just baseball. Another big spot to fill comes 90 feet from home plate at first base, where Anthony Smith and Adam Furness are battling for the starting job. You know, may the best man win. Whatever happens, happens, but we'll, we're, I'm going to enjoy the game. One of the last few differences this year's team has from the 2018 squad comes from inside the dugout. Pitching coach Rick Blank decided to step down and is being replaced by Kyle Halleck. The Falcons have a doubleheader versus Tri-C Community College on September 23rd at Stellar Field. For BG24, I'm Leo Goldman.